What's going on, everybody? It's Jay Coffee Talk. Good morning, you guys. Caught something here on Twitter I thought was pretty funny. Duke Williams. Uh, there's two Duke Williams in this situation. What's up, Bills Mafia? All my Bills fans out there. Everyone hit the like, subscribe, hit the notification bell if you're a football fan, NFL fan. Lots of NFL content coming this season, but check this out. You see here it says, thanks, NFL, but I don't play for them anymore, although I'll need a check for using my intellectual property. This is Duke Williams tweeting this, who was a safety for the Bills. Um, what was he with us, like two or three years? He was a safety we drafted. Um, you know, he's not with us anymore. I believe we cut him at some point or whatever. I'm going to give you a little more information about him in the future, but he had a nice touchdown, or sorry, not him. The other Duke Williams who played in the CFL had a nice touchdown last night in our preseason game against Carolina. That's who they're showing in this clip here. I'd replay it for you, but I don't want the NFL flag in my video. So uh, check out the, the replies in this thread here. Chris Craig, also a former Buffalo Bill tight end. He said, the only Duke I acknowledge, LOL. He uh, replied with this funny meme here. If it loads up, yeah, it's that to this day from Wilder. And then this person, uh, girl here, she put, once a bill, always a bill. Great story. Played on defense. Came back on offense. LOL. So you just clown it because this is the wide receiver, Duke. Now check out, um, if you keep going through here, pay the man his money. Does the NFL know Mia Khalifa ended your career years ago? I'm going to talk about that in a minute. Uh, he had a little thing with porn star Mia Khalifa. He said, LOL, what about that baseball car? Oops. And uh, he's talking about something about this guy's account. He's being a good sport. People are making jokes a little bit. He said, what happened to get you released overnight? That's usually how it goes. It's just they're all being funny. They're being, you know, smart asses clowning around. It's not the right guy. The NFL tagged the wrong Duke Johnson. And then I'm, you'll always be Bills Mafia, Duke, NFL, laugh and face. Keep hustling, man. Bills Mafia pulling for you. Love what we're seeing. I think that guy actually might have not realized that this was incorrect. But that's what this was all about. The NFL tagged the Duke Williams that used to play for us, that played defense for the touchdown for the Duke Williams who plays for us now. Now, let's uh, see the Duke Williams who plays for us now. All right, so this is the Duke Williams who actually caught the touchdown pass. If you see, there's an article up here on Bill's Wire about him after his performance last night. And you see it says th six things to know about Bill's wide receiver, Duke Williams. That's who they meant to tag. And as you see here in the article, I'm just going to kind of skim over it and, uh, you know, paraphrase it or whatever. But it just says, you know, the Bills nabbed a free agent at an odd time for the second straight year. It talks about Vontae Davis, which we all know was the veteran corner that we grabbed last uh, last season. And he uh, quit the team. Or was that last season or the season before? I've, I've blocked this dude out of my mind. Actually, I believe it was the season before when we broke the drought. <clears throat> he retired at halftime. Straight up some punk-ish. But anyways, um, it says his name might already sound familiar because it's already worn a Buffalo Bills uniform before, but it isn't, but this isn't former defensive back Duke Williams. It's a whole new guy. So who is he? And see what it says. He was a CFL all-star. He came to Buffalo an interesting route. The former undrafted rookie from the 2016 NFL draft was recently with the Edmonton Eskimos of the CFL. So, there you go, guys. That's the real, well, I shouldn't say the real Duke Williams, but that's the Duke Williams the NFL meant to tag. And here is uh, the Duke Williams that they did tag. I just pulled up his Wikipedia page here, but you just see, you know, he's a safety. We drafted in the fourth uh, round of the 2013 draft. And, I mean, I don't know. He didn't see the field that much. He wasn't the starter. I forget who used to start ahead of him. But you see he was with the Bills from 2013 to 16 and then spent one year with the Colts. And, you know, he hasn't been able to get a contract since. So, um, 
there's that. But this is, I guess, what you would say the highlight of Duke's career, and it's uh, not such a great highlight. So this was uh, porn star Mia Khalifa. This was in her uh, DMs. And um, back in 2015, you see the dates. Duke had been hitting her up for about a three-month period. Come to Vegas, yo, you in Miami. Hits her with the eye emoji, come to Miami. She says, I am in Miami after, you know, a three-month period, like I said, with my boyfriend. And you see what she says after that. I ain't about to say that. And then, he said, you know, you see what he says. He's still trying to hit her up after that. And she says, K, since you can't take a hint... Or a curve, maybe a block of work. Roasted him. She tweeted it out on Twitter for everyone to see. And, uh, you know, that's what Duke Williams is mainly known for <laughs> when his name gets pulled up. As I said, he wasn't, he didn't really do too much with the team. And, um, you know, what a four year, three year career. And everyone knows him for this Mia Khalifa thing. But that's the story of the two Dukes. Involving, you know, the Buffalo Bills and the NFL with this case of mistaken identity. Um, tell me what you guys think about all this. Thanks for tuning in, you guys. It's Jay Coffee Talk. I'll catch you on the next video. I'm out of here. Make sure you like and subscribe. You hit the notification bell, as I've been saying. Tons of NFL content coming all season, you guys. And I always want to hear what you guys got to say in the comments. And I also cover sports, music, news, life current events and much more. I'm out, y'all.